without any people is kind of creepy. Well, I should start my investigation. Where should I start? Oh, that's... the Spectacled Man! It's you. Don't call me by such a weird name. I'm sorry, I don't know your name. But what a coincidence to meet you here! Coincidence? Considering the peculiarities of this place, I'd prefer to think it was inevitable. Huh? So is the disappearance of these villagers related to Neo? I told you, I'm not the one who should be searching for that answer. But my sister's life is at stake! She might be living through some scary nightmare somewhere! If you know something, please tell me! Um, Mr. Spectacles? It's Keith Griff. Just call me Keith. I can't stand being called such weird names. Okay. Mr. Keith, um... Sorry, but I'm not good at being friendly, so if you'll excuse me... So these villagers are somehow related to Neo. I can't stand around like this. I need to investigate. here. That's weird. I thought they all disappeared. Something strange is going on. Something doesn't feel normal. B but I came here to investigate, so I need to start investigating. I need to get a closer look and check everything out. H Hello, my name is Aisha. I heard there were reports of people disappearing. Can you tell me anything about that? Whoa! They disappeared! Humans can't just disappear like that. So, could these really be the vengeful ghosts that Marion was talking about? <sighs> what? Again? What's she doing in this village? No, no, that doesn't matter right now. Neo! Neo, it's me! Can't you tell? Look at me! I never thought I'd see you in a place like this. 
So you surprised me. Disappeared. But why? She smiled at me before. The flowers! They're glowing! I remember him saying that investigating the flowers was also a key. I'll just pick one of these flowers. It might lead me to Neo in the future. If I keep collecting these kinds of flowers, I'm sure... someday... I wonder what this is? It's pretty and mysterious, and... I've never seen anything like it before. Marion did say to bring back anything out of the ordinary. This seems really out of the ordinary. If I take it back... Wait. Oh, the spectacled man. I thought I told you to call me Keith. Anyway, do you understand what this is? I was just gonna take it back for the time being. Is it special? I was impressed that you took an interest in this place. But I guess you're still only at that level. Looks like you don't need this right now. I'd better take it instead. But... but, um... I was ordered to bring back anything that's out of the ordinary. And... it may be a clue to finding Neo. Even so, it won't do you any good yet. This item is too advanced for you. I shall put it to good use instead. However, I was first to pick it up. But let's see. I'll give you advice in exchange. This place is connected to the place we met. Although that connection is only a temporary phenomenon. They're... connected? The earlier illusion is proof. You can discover the rest for yourself. Um... Please, tell me more about what you know. What happened to this village and Neo? Do they have something in common? I thought I told you to use your own hands, feet, and head to find the truth for yourself. I despise people who don't put in any effort or devotion themselves, and only seek results the most. Uh, he's being mean again. Uh, Mr. Keith is about to leave! But what should I do? Wait, you. You said your name is Keith. In that case, I cannot let you leave. W what's wrong, Linka? Why are you pulling out your sword all of a sudden? Miss, I have no recollection of you. Damaging property and entering buildings and... and... Anyway, Marion said to capture you. Brace yourself, Keith Grip Hazeldine. Don't say such scary things! I couldn't care less how society judges me. However, I can't stand by and do nothing when I'm exposed to danger. Uh, huh? Why is the atmosphere turning threatening all of a sudden? I will seize you with all my might! Aisha, don't let your guard down! Huh? A am I gonna take part in this too? Take this!
Take this! Goodness, it's rather difficult to go easy on someone. I'm sorry, but I don't have any more time to keep you company. So, farewell. Ouch! Mr. Keith ended up taking what I found. I should go report back to Marion. What strength he has! He did not even seem to notice me.
So welcome! Are you here to take part in the treasure trove contest? Oh, I think I remember Mr. Harry saying something about that. Um, should I? Yes, I'd love to participate! Oh, you're pretty motivated. Then let's get you signed up. I wasn't sure if we were gonna have enough participants to open the contest, but we do now! Get ready right away! What? Like, right away, right away? Of course. Mr. Owner has been way too enthusiastic about it and has been getting ready for a while now. So just go straight to the stage and get ready for your turn, please. Uh, okay. Uh, I hope I can do this. Okay, I would like to start the 10th thrilling treasure contest. First of all, let's have a message from the organizer. Ladies and gentlemen who adore fine and rare items, welcome to the thrilling treasure contest. I am the organizer and winner of the last event, Harry Olsen. This is the contest's 10th running, and I take pride in how our recognition around the world has advanced. And as a matter of fact, I am also proud of you folks. Now, mystery items still slumber all over the world. To collect those items and to make their presence known to all, I'd like each participant to adopt this noble ideal and exert themselves. And eventually... Okay, thank you very much. Let's give him a big round of applause. Harry is the same as always. Oh, Regina? You're gonna compete too? Yep. I have a business relationship with him. I'm taking a break, and I'd rather slack off at my house, but... Anyway, I'm more surprised that you're here, Aisha. <laughs> I couldn't really say no. I see. I guess we have the same motive. Well, 
Let's just take it easy and... And today, we have a new victim! I mean, participant! The go-getter apothecary, Aisha! Huh? Come on, stop looking so silly and please give us a short speech. Huh? Oh, yes, um... I I'll do my best! Thank you! <laughs> How innocent! Now, the 10th thrilling treasure contest... We'll begin! Now, before we get to the competition, let's meet all of our exhibitors. Everyone, please give us a short introduction. First up is our organizer who was just introduced, Mr. Harry Olsen. Please keep it short. Why, hello! I hope you're all having fun. I shall show you all my collection. Next is Regina, who has taken part in this contest every time. Yes, hello! Well, like always, let's take it easy. Our next exhibitor came from a faraway land and works as a bodyguard, Ms. Linka! I am not sure what this is all about, but battling is my forte. I will win. And here's our final exhibitor, Ms. Aisha! Y yes Um, so well... Uh, I'll do my best! Okay, thank you very much! I'm so excited to see what kind of items will be shown! Continuing on, I'd now like to introduce all the judges! First is Mr. Harry Olsen, whose privilege for being the organizer allows him to serve as a judge. <laughs> People, I expect to see an item that'll surpass mine! Although, I'm sure that's a tall order. Okay, how childish. And please, allow me, the host, to be a judge as well. Items that'll sell in the store. I mean, I'll be looking forward to all the wonderful items. Now, our next judge is an official who tediously carries out her duties throughout the region, Ms. Marion. <clears throat> I'll be giving strict evaluations, so be ready. Our next judge travels to various places as a peddler, the good-natured Mr. Ernie. Hello. I'm excited to see what kinds of items are going to be presented. Good luck, everyone. Okay, that concludes the judge introductions. Everyone, please put all your might into your judging. Now I'd like to go ahead and start the contest. Contestants, please get ready for your turn. It looks like it's starting. We need to decide which item to exhibit. I need to try my best and choose something the judges might like. Let's see. I would now like to start our contest. First contestant, come on down! Well, this item comes with my highest recommendation. I'm convinced that there are no other items like it in the world. Okay then, judges. Please assess these items carefully. Start your assessments now! Please, come on down! Okay, okay. This is the one I'm presenting. Please take a look at my finest of fine items. Okay then, judges. Please assess these items carefully. Start your assessments now! Yes, 
assessment. Next person, please come on down! This is the item I decided on, after multiple examinations and inspections. Please judge it well. Okay then, judges. Please assess these items carefully. Start your assessments now! For the final exhibitor, Aisha, please come on down! Uh, okay. Thank you for having me. Now, what will the results be? Let the assessment start. Announcing the results! The winner is... The organizer, Mr. Harry Olsen! Congratulations! <laughs> well... It was the inevitable result. From here on out, I will not be unseated as champion so easily. Wow, they were all great! I'd like to ask our event organizer, Mr. Harry, to comment on the results. Yup. With so many high-level items as the organizer, nothing could make me happier but... I guess no contestant can surpass me! I'd like all of you to keep working hard! I'll be looking forward to facing a contestant who can satisfy me next time! Of course, I'll... Okay, thank you very much! That's all for now! Dismissed! Aww, we lost! I guess Mr. Harry is pretty awesome! But I had fun, so I guess it's okay! I'll try my best next time. Well, everyone, thank you so much for sticking around till the end. Please look forward to the next contest. <laughs>